Are you really suggesting that Barney spent six months commuting back and forth to Hoboken to learn a signature cooking style of a restaurant he doesn't even like? To commute. To make the same journey regularly. For example, between work and home. Examples. You, you wanted us to come? Of course. That was the plan. So I took the post in Tibet. I tried to commute while I got settled in. C commute from Tibet to JFK? Yeah. And I promised your mother that I would be home on a Tuesday and I would show up on Friday the following week. You're probably going to be seeing me a lot more considering I want to move back home and commute to school next semester. Wow, really? Yeah, it's only a half hour drive. Are you mad? Mad? Are you kidding me? I'm thrilled. You know how much I miss you. I am going to tell her that I need to redecorate my condo and I need her help. We will haggle about money and I will back down. To haggle, to argue, especially about the price of something. Examples. What do you mean you bought this house? I mean, I made a bid online. I won the auction the next day and I got approval. I just finalized the paperwork. And was the Blair Witch easy to deal with, or did she haggle over the closing costs? Don't even joke about that, man. This is the reason you brought me, okay? I know how to haggle, so let me handle this from here on out. Can I help you? Uh, yeah, yes, I would like to see that ring, please. Or not, whatever. <laughs> how much is it? Chandler, I'll, I will handle this. How much is it? 8,600. We will give you $10. <laughs> Did you show Lily your design? No. What design? It's nothing. It's fantastic. <sighs> Just read, you should pitch your building to Druthers. Are you kidding? He's Hammond Druthers. He's a legend. I'm just part of his team. To pitch, to talk about, or describe something in a favorable way, so that people will want to accept it. To promote, or advertise something. To throw. Examples. I think there's something you should maybe know. Well, it better not be about the apartment pants because I just pitched the idea to my boss at Ralph Lauren and she loved it. <laughs> okay, so if there's nothing else... Actually, um, if, if, if you don't mind, I'd like to show you some designs of my own. Oh. So corporate's pitching creative ideas now? I know I don't look like I've just rode to work on my skateboard. <laughs> <laughs> Snap, look at you. But for people who are paid to think outside the box, you people are pretty inside the box. Hey, look. Mrs. Luther said she had a story and wanted to meet. She must have been getting off the elevator when someone intercepted her. You know, I, I heard the gunshot, I saw the elevator going down, so I took the stairs. To intercept. To stop and catch something or someone before the thing or person is able to reach a particular place. Examples. I just left. Well, you have to go back in. What, go back? I'm so sorry, honey, but... Okay, Rachel gave this guy her number, and um, she doesn't want Ross to answer the phone, so you have to intercept all his calls. I can't do that. He says he can't do that. Oh, Kevin! Ooh! <laughs> uh, nice catch. Mm, 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 mm. Oscar! Intercepted! Right here. That. Give it to me. Phyllis, give me the ball. Okay, give me the ball. Give me, you guys, Ooh, Creed, cool. give me the ball right here, now. Michael, give it to me. Ryan. But I've been working on this a long time. Trust me, it'll work. You don't see your mistake, do you? There's no mistake. This is for a full-scale rocket, not a model. Well, I've adjusted the formula. Not correctly. <laughs> to adjust. To change something slightly, especially to make it more correct, effective, or suitable. To become more familiar with a new situation. Examples. There are three things you want to do before you ride. Manny. Check your shoelaces, adjust your mirror, and test your belt. Okay, shoelaces tied. The mirror is good. I'm still not adjusted to how the Sci-Fi Channel spells their name now. S-Y-F-Y, that's Siffy. <laughs> uh-huh. Why, why did I have to speak in a British accent? What, what do we do? Well, why don't you phase it out? Yeah, phase the accent out. People will think that you're, you know, just adjusting to life in America. Yeah, I mean, come on, Ross. No one will even notice. I mean, they're probably not even listening to you. <laughs>
Barney spent six months commuting back and forth to Hoboken. So you have to intercept all his calls. I've adjusted the formula, not correctly. This is the reason you brought me, okay? I know how to haggle.